digital purchase order. This is a quick introduction on how to track invoices, which will help you to match invoices against purchase order totals and compare them with your deliveries if you track these as well. In the end, you can generate a three-way match between the PO amount, deliveries and invoices. To activate this feature, please visit the Administration section and select the Users tab. Here, you can edit the profiles of relevant users by ticking the checkbox Can Manage Invoices. When using the Invoice feature, you can choose between two modes. The Simple mode gives you the option of adding the invoice number and invoice date, as well as the corresponding order number. Below this, you can insert a name and the net price of the invoice, as well as write notes. If you are using the advanced mode, you can track invoices against the items in the PO. In this way, DPO will know whether all invoices have been received or whether there are any outstanding bills. To select your desired mode, please go to the Administration section, select the Invoices tab, and choose the corresponding invoice setting. DPO's purchase orders operate with net totals only, but invoices often include taxes or VAT, so you can predefine them in the Administration section. Simply go to Administration and select Taxes. Here, click on the pen icon for any available line and provide your tax with a name in addition to making it visible for the invoice feature. The selection of the tax item can also be made a required field. Since tax items may have different percentages, you need to decide whether people should be able to enter a variable tax percentage manually or select it from a list. If there are many percentages available, you can even choose a searchable list. Once this is done, press Save. Click the arrow icon on the left and click the plus button on the right. In here, you can define the tax value, give it a name, and optionally, a valid time frame. With this new setup, you can go back to your invoice data set and select your relevant taxes. Please note that you are not limited to one tax item. If you have multiple taxes in your country, DPO can manage this too by enabling multiple taxes for invoices. By the way, if you have permission to edit these invoice entries, click on the PO and select the corresponding invoice item. At the bottom, you can either edit or delete this data set completely. If you have our attachment feature active, you can also upload an invoice receipt here. The uploaded file will then be visible as an appended attachment within this PO. In this way, you can summarize all relevant information in one place, and you will not have to search in various locations. If you have any further questions, please send us an email to support at digitalpurchaseorder.com or give us a call on 1-888-376-7254. We can also arrange a demo appointment with you. Simply contact us via email and we will schedule a call at your earliest convenience. We hope that you enjoyed this video. Please also check out our other video tutorials on the main tutorial page.